Protect Insect Control Package that's been developed using similar techniques to previous things that have been marketed in cotton for about 26 years or so, going on 30 years. When you think about what Thrive On is and what it typically, what we believe it can offer to a cotton grower, it is a, a gene expressed in a cryoprotein derived from similar techniques as we have with, with earlier products. It happens to target a novel and unique set of insects that we've not had a specific tool like this to target in the past. The things a grower could expect to see from Thrive On as he realizes the technology and sees it in commercial use would be hopefully increased fruit accumulation through the year, an ability to eliminate some of the risk associated with managing some of these pests we've, had, we've not had these sorts of tools to manage before. The thing that makes Thrive On different versus a lot of other cotton traits that have entered the marketplace in my career is the fact that it's the first cotton trait that has been targeted toward pretty unique and serious cotton pests that exist across a lot of the cotton belt, that being thrips and ligus. It's a technology that's been developed uh, using similar, similar tools and similar techniques versus the things that exist in the marketplace currently, but it is the first one that's going to offer some level of whole plant protection against those pests and thrips and ligus. As far as the potential shifts in scouting and how they affect the grower, I think those changes are pointing out some of the inevitable change involved in this conversation. That's not to say anybody's doing this wrong today, but as circumstances change, new technologies come along and new varieties are introduced, we're going to have to make a few changes. And I think what we're headed toward will probably be a little more in-depth study of the plant combined with some insect data that we're using today. It's not going to be a radical shift in how you go out and manage a cotton field. It's going to be a recombination of things that we've done in the past already.